All right, guys, day four. Um, it might look a little messed up because my phone is actually in a paper, uh, not a paper bag, a plastic bag. Um, it's kind of rainy day. So, but we're still getting it. You can kind of see some of the view back there. Uh, we're just an outcropping. Brandon is uh, making a pit stop. So I figured I'd just uh, say hey. And we're still getting it. Um, just came out of Neil Gap. Uh, probably a couple, a couple miles out now. Today's only going to be like an eight-mile day. We're uh, scaling back the miles. We did 12 the first two days, and we decided that's just a little bit too much right now. So uh, we'll get back up to there, of course. But right now, we're just going to take it easy. Try to enjoy the hike and uh, go to this shelter that's off the trail. Heard a lot of people don't use it, so uh, we're going to go check it out. And uh, might have a couple visitors tonight, we hope, anyway. But hopefully it's not too crowded. Because of the rain, we're going to try to get into the shelter as opposed to tenting. But uh, I'll see you all there. All right, little on-trail update. How you doing back there, Brandon? Woo! We uh, came out of Neil Gap this morning and uh, planned on doing eight miles today. And uh, we're gone beyond that now. Far um, beyond it. <laughs> but we're both feeling good. We did 12 miles the first two days, and I tell you what, it sucked. Um, and, you know, you guys might not be getting a lot of videos these first couple weeks because we're just trying to get used to the trail. Um, last Yesterday and today, though, it definitely felt more, you know, like, hey, I'm through hiking. Um, the first two days, like I said, basically just sucked. So it was cold. It was hard. You know, our legs were achy and tired and... Heck, day two, we rolled into camp and just went to bed. We didn't even eat. Well, we ate a little bit, but we didn't cook anything. So um, today, we're heading down to a place called Low Gap Shelter. It's uh, a little after 3 in the afternoon. We figure we're almost there, so and we both feel like we got lots of energy, so we're, we're good to go. Um, one step closer, you know, because that's one of the perks of hiking the Appalachian Trail, is all of a sudden, next thing you know, you're just a hiking badass. So, um, legs feel good, energy level's good. Feet, feeling it in the feet just a little bit today. Uh, Brandon said his feet are feeling a little bit too, so. Um, but other than that, we're doing good. I'll talk to y'all later. All right, quick update. Um, left Low Gap Shelter, heading to Trey Mountain Shelter. We may stop before we get there, depending on how we feel. Um, right now, we're both feeling real good, so things are going great. It's a little bit warm, a little bit wet today. I don't know if you can tell, it's cloudy. Um, but anyway, like I said, we're feeling good. I think today we're trying to knock out about 14 miles, so um, so much for slowing down. But like I said, I guess if we, if we feel like we need to slow down, we will. But, you know, yesterday we did 12 and felt great. So we're just going to keep going with it, see what happens. I'll talk to you all later. How you doing, Brandon? <laughs> oh, I'm doing amazing. Where are you right now? I'm at the Budget Inn. Is it a budget or what? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Check this place out. <laughs> it don't get much better than this. Through that stream, I here. tell you what. Look at we, we got We got no plumbing and everything. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about right there. Running water. Anyway, we, uh... Hey, look at there I am. We, uh... We got chased off the trail by some weather, so we're, we're both soaking wet, so we're trying to get dry, get some food, and uh, we're heading back out tomorrow, but we definitely needed to come in today. It was pretty nasty out there. So, we got the budget in. It don't get no better than this. Anyway, I'll talk.